Hey guys, what's up and welcome to iCode. In this video, we're gonna learn how to install programs and how to update sources in Kali Linux. So, let's get started. Open up VirtualBox so that you could get access to all the virtual machines installed on your VirtualBox. And right here you can see the Kali Linux virtual machine. So tap on this start button, that is green color button. So to start your Kali Linux virtual machine. And wait for it to open. Type in the username that is root R O T and type in the password that is reverse of root that is T O O R. Sign in. Great. Now that we are in Kali Linux operating system, in this video we are going to learn how to install a program called Terminator. And we are going to install that particular program using Terminal. So open up Terminal. And guys, in this Kali Linux operating system, we are going to install all the applications using this terminal. Okay? Fine. Now. To install any program in Kali Linux, that is any application in Kali Linux, what you need to do is you need to type in apt hyphen get space install and the program name, that is the application name. So for this video, we're gonna install a program called Terminator. Terminator is some kind of terminal, but it has some advanced options. I'll show that to you after installing that program. Fine, great. So let me just type in the name of that particular program, so Terminator. But to install any program or application in Kali Linux, we need to update the sources first. So before installing any program, remember you need to update the sources. And how to update the sources? Well, you need to type in this particular command that is apt hyphen get space update. So let me just type in the command and press enter. So now that the sources are updated, we can install this particular terminator application into your Kali Linux operating system. So for that, what you need to do is you need to type in apt hyphen get space install the application name that is Terminator, T-E-R-M-I-N-A-T-O-R, enter. So now that Terminator is installed to your Kali Linux operating system, you can just access Terminator from this applications menu. So tap on this show applications menu and type in Terminator. So Terminator and here you can see the Terminator application right here. We have just installed it using Terminal. So tap on this terminator so that you could use terminator. So as I told, terminator is similar to terminal. You can use all the commands that we have used in terminal. For example, use pw so that you could know the name of your working directory. Right, so let me just type in clear so to clear the entire screen. Fine. Well, I forgot to tell you one more thing. Just wait a second. So there's also another command which can upgrade your system that is Kali Linux operating system and for that what you need to do is you need to type in apt hyphen get space upgrade and you need to press enter and this will upgrade your Kali Linux operating system for you. Well, I don't use this particular command because whenever a new Kali Linux version is into the market I just install it manually. So I don't use this particular command that is apt get upgrade because there may be many libraries that are broken. So that is the reason I don't use this particular app get update sorry upgrade so I advise you not to use it as well that's it and now let's go to terminator application again so tap on this terminator icon and now let me just type in pwd again so to find the name of the working directory now say that you want to work with two terminals or multiple terminals so in terminator what you can do is right click on this particular terminal and you need to select this particular option that is split horizontally and now you can see that we have got two terminals we have got two terminals to work with right now no need to use two separate terminals we can work with two terminals in one terminator you can actually divide this terminator into two terminals vertically as well so all you need to do is right click on this particular terminal window and select this particular option that is split vertically and now you have three terminals to work with. So this is the advantage in using Terminator over Terminal. So guys, this is how we install programs and update sources in Kali Linux using Terminal. All you need to do is first update the sources by typing this particular command that is apt hyphen get space update. And after this, to install any program, all you need to do is you need to type in apt hyphen get space install and the program name that is the application name and that particular application will be installed for you that's it this is how you do it with terminal in kali linux so that's it for this video thanks for watching this video don't forget to subscribe and i'll be back with another awesome kali linux video goodbye <laughs>